Hello, my beautiful friends. How are you doing? I hope you're doing really, really well. So today we're going to be continuing the 100 baby challenge. I have been, to say the least, obsessed with this series so far. Uh, it's extremely frustrating. Yes, don't get me wrong, but <laughs> it's also really addicting just because of how like fun it is and how I, I don't know I just want to like get it done you feel me I want to get this done in as few episodes as possible it's like I'm I was torn between taking my time with it getting to know the kids you know actually giving them outfits giving them CC like the whole bit or just like just really getting through it and not really caring about the kids. I don't know, I don't know. I guess I'll probably care about them more once they become teenagers and become like their own person. You know what I mean? But for the most part right now, I kind of just want to like pump out as many kids as possible. <laughs> I just want to thank you guys for all the positive feedback you've been giving me on these videos. I appreciate it so much. And I wanted to answer a few questions that I keep seeing in the comments. The first question is um, a lot of people have been asking me how I record my game. Um, I've used three different programs. I'm on Mac, by the way. Um, so the first program I used was QuickTime. That's free. It's a free and easy way to record your screen. But it was giving me a little bit of problems just because of how long my episodes are. It couldn't like handle that big of a file, that big of a recording. So I switched to another free program called Monosnap, and that one is great. It's really, really great. It's probably the best free screen recorder I've ever used. I highly recommend that one. But that one was giving me some issues with my game audio. <laughs> so I decided to invest in a program, and it's called Snagit. Snagit? <laughs> it was... Um, $30 with the student discount, but it has proven to be the most reliable screen recording program I have used so far. So I just wanted to get that out there. Sorry if this is boring. Um, and also another question that I keep getting is, do I wear wigs? And yes, I do. I do because I think it's fun and I like to switch up my hair color because I can't really dye my hair because it's extremely delicate. I'll show you guys a picture of my natural hair right here. But yeah, I just like to wear them because I think they're really athletic, <laughs> athletically, <laughs> aesthetically pleasing in my videos and it's just fun and I like it. So I hope you guys don't mind. So yeah, enough chit chatting. Let's get into today's video. I'm so excited. Okay guys, here we are back in the house. As you can see, I have made some changes to the house. I got us some money by selling things. I changed the floors and the carpeting to cheaper. So I got some money back from that. And then I sold like all of our landscape. So like our trees and our plants. So yeah, that gave us like a good amount of money. And also there was like a crystal out here just chilling that was worth like $200. That really came in clutch. I also sold her dresser. Oh boy, you poor thing. Why don't you just like sleep for reals, please? Um. So yeah, I added more beds to the toddler room. I got them the cheaper bed, so I was able to afford more. Um, so yeah, this is the new room. There's a, now a bed for each toddler, which is great. I changed the counter color, I changed the couch color, and also I made this separate room for the babies. Isn't it cute? I'm just like high key obsessed with it. This is a uh, custom, custom content wallpaper. I just think it's so adorable. So yeah, now that she can, so now that that is in a separate room, she can finally get some decent sleep. I know that's like not a good thing because now the babies are just gonna like keep crying. <laughs> but you know what? It is what it is. What else? What else? Well, I'm trying to think of like some of the advice that you guys gave me. Okay, I can't really think of anything right now. But this was the one of the babies we had. Uh, recently, she's one of the twins. Her name is Mia, I think. So now we have a Leah and a Mia. She's actually super, super adorable. Look at that. Look at that. Oh my god. And then her twin, Romeo, he is having a nap over here, but I, uh, I fixed them up in Create a Sim. One of you guys said that you wanted me to actually like show when I'm in Create a Sim, so I'll try to do that more. Um, the Sims gave him this hair. I don't normally like Sims hair, but I wanted to keep this hair so much. I think it's so cute. So I just left it. He's actually really interesting looking. I'll try and show you guys in Create a Sim soon, but I think he's like the most unique looking toddler I have ever seen in The Sims. 
So I'm really stoked about that. So yeah, uh, I think that's all I wanted to say. Um, oh, uh, actually, off camera, I kind of built up a relationship with a guy before I started recording right now because I know that that can tend to be kind of boring, <laughs> like watching relationship building. So this is him, his name is Reed, so he's going to be our next baby daddy, if we can even try for baby with him. I haven't tried it yet, and I still don't know why we couldn't try for baby with those two vampire dudes. I tried to find something online about it, like if it's like a glitch or something, but I couldn't find anything. And uh, it's really frustrating because I really want vampire babies because they're worth double. And it's totally worth it. Oh, you little... <laughs> He was just running around naked. Ew, and he just farted. That's really disgusting. Okay, I think you've had enough sleep. It looks like Mia really needs a bath. So let's just give her a bath. And then once it strikes 7 a.m., we're going to invite Reed over. And hopefully try for baby. Hopefully. And her aspiration, what does she want to do? Read to a child for two total hours. I think that's doable. Don't you guys think? I mean, she's got enough children. She's already level seven of the parenting skill. That is insane. Okay, who's this little bean? Who is that? Who is this? He needs a bath. So does Romeo. So, ew, look at that bath. Oh man, that's disgusting. Give bath to Romeo. Let's get him up. This is the thing I find the hardest. Oh, look. How cute is that? You guys said to have them, like, talk to each other to get their attention up. And it looks like their attention is actually okay. Hers is going up because she's chatting with Mia. Oh, they are so cute, you guys. Even though... Leah, Leah and Mia. <laughs> Even though Leah is filthy, this is still such a cute little scene right here. And we got so unlucky last time with our twins, they both got the fussy trait. <sighs> God, I wanted to scream when that happened. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Please clean this before I barf all over my keyboard. And then you need to give a bath to Leah, please. Look at them. They're sitting on the couch talking to each other. How cute! And Leah, what are your skills like? We can't age you up yet because you're still level 1 potty and level 2 thinking, so we should work on that. And then you... Um, you need your imagination and your thinking and your potty. You don't even have the potty skill. When even is y'all's birthday? Oh, look at that. Zero! So was it your birthday? I didn't get a notification. Does that mean we can age them up? What is that? Depressed? You poor thing. Oh my god, she really needs a bath. Why are you giving him a bath and not her? I'm pretty sure I asked you to give her a bath. Okay, so why don't you drink one of these sleep replacements? I think this is it. Yeah, it's this one. So go ahead and drink that so we can get some stuff done. Uh, so which one of these babies needs a bath? Aiden. Okay. No, no, not you. Not you. You don't deserve a shower. <laughs> I need you to give a bath to Aiden, please. Okay, you're taking a shower first? That's fine, I guess, because we still need to invite homeboy over. Where is he? Where is he? Reed. He's actually really cute. I think you guys are gonna like him. Cute. She's a good mom, guys. I'm just gonna get her to, uh, order a pizza. Uh, let's do a cheese one. Look, he's here, he's here, he's here! Oh my gosh, we can woohoo him already? Wow, he, like, just got here. Okay. Come on. Come on. Attempt to seduce him. And then let's see if we can do this. Okay, we can! So it has to do with the vampire thing. One of you guys has to know. Please let me know because it's really frustrating me that I can't have vampire babies. Because they are worth so much! Where's the pizza guy? Are you, are you taking a pregnancy test? Yeah, I know she's very hungry, but like... 
The pizza man just isn't coming. Yo, this child over here is foul. Who is this? Brenton. Okay, Brenton. You really need a bath. No, I don't want to come to your birthday party. I'm sorry. I know that sounds harsh, but like... Nope. Are you pregnant? Yes! Girl, you are so freaking fertile. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> she told him that she- <gasps> It's Leah's birthday. Oh, thank God. Holy crap. It means- it's, it, That means it's everyone else's birthday, too. Yes, queen. Okay, let, let's cook a cake. Let's cook a chocolate cake. That means we're gonna need another bathroom for sure. Oh no, and then we're gonna have to buy like real beds. <gasps> yes, Cliff. Yes, yes, yes. No! I thought that was Cliff wanting to come over. Alright, alright. Don't, 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 don't anyone take a piece. Add birthday candles. Um, help blow out candles. Um, Leah. Yeah, because she was the oldest. And then I'm pretty sure it was Aiden and then, okay, Aiden and then Brenton. Okay. All right. Moment of truth. Time to see how our first baby. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Okay. We're going to have to randomize. A world-renowned actress? Is that a custom trait? Okay, I guess she's gonna be an actress. Uh, so let's make her aspiration creative. <laughs> That's weird! I have like all of these custom traits, so there's more traits than normal. And I guess, I think that might be one of them, I'm not really sure. I guess we should probably enroll her into acting school, uh, or the acting club, or whatever you call it. Older and wiser. Have a sim age up. Oh, this is a new game. Okay, help blow out candles. Aiden. Well, Leah, you're not supposed to be blonde. Woo! Alright, here we go. Why do I always get this trait? Oh! If you guys are watching my legacy challenge, the next heir, my first son, freaking got the kleptomaniac trait and the mischief aspiration. So annoying. Uh, okay, let's do social for him. A kleptomaniac child. <laughs> What kind of crap is that? <laughs> Quick, add candles before someone takes a slice. Okay, let's help out Brenton. Aiden, you're looking mighty pale there. What's this? Oh, yeah. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Hilarious! That's cute! Okay, he'll be a social butterfly too then. Hilarious sims can never go wrong with a joke. They have a few extra special ones up their sleeve. How cute is that? Okay. I finally figured out what was wrong with my cheat bar, so I was able to fix it. So now we can modify them and create a sim without having an issue. <laughs> that was really frustrating me because modifying our kids and create a sim is like what I live for. It's like my favorite part. Oh wow. You are interesting looking. I'll give you that. So she had black hair before, so I think let's keep it black. And she had like a short pony. It was this one. Yeah, let's keep her with this hair. I thought that was really cute on her. And I think it gave her the same brows. It did. That's amazing. For some reason she's got lip gloss on. She's just gonna take that right off. <laughs> she's so pretty. Oh my gosh, she's got like her dad's Asian looks. So cool. All right, and then we're just gonna pop on this skin detail because it's my favorite. Or maybe not, it looks kind of funky on her. 
That's way too realistic. I like lucid skin. All right, lucid skin it is. And then let's just give her some lashes. Very important. Okay, so she's gonna be an actress. So I feel like she's going to dress very, very like glam. Uh, very like, I don't know. How do you explain it? You know when kids just like really wanna be like fancy? and kind of adult-like. So let's see if there's anything like that in here. There's this, it came with Get Famous. <laughs> Is this too flashy for a child her age? I mean, come on, it looks like a Versace jacket. Maybe, maybe it is too fancy for now. She could wear this Gucci, like, oversized, um, Sweater. I mean, we definitely can't afford Gucci, but maybe it's like a knockoff that she got at like the thrift store or something. I don't know. <laughs> I like it. I like her. She's cute. You know, I'm pretty sure she had freckles when she was a kid too. So we should definitely give those back to her. Yeah, she had freckles and then she had like this beauty marker right here, if I remember correctly. I don't understand like what happened with The Sims, but like with skin details, whenever you put like skin details on their everyday outfit, it like crossed over to like the rest of the outfit. But ever since the update, it like went away. It's so frustrating because now you have to go to like every outfit and add skin details. <laughs> It's just not fair! God. Sims, man. They're just so good at making things frustrating, am I right? Okay, gang, here is Leah, our firstborn. Let's move on to Aiden. Um, I'm pretty sure you have some funky skin details on. There he is! Oh my god, this- <gasps> You guys! This is one of the cutest kids I have ever seen in The Sims. I absolutely love this hair on him. It is like a Sims hair, but it looks so good! I think we might have to keep it. I mean, this was his hair that he had when he was a child. I mean, that's really cute too, but like, I don't know. I'm really feeling this one. I think it's adorable, so we're just gonna keep that one. He had freckles too. They're all triplets, so they should have the same skin details. So the lucid skin with the all over freckles. And the little beauty mark. He's our little kleptomaniac too. Dang, how should we dress him? All right, let's see. What you wearing right now? You have a bowling shirt? <laughs> That's actually kind of cute. What do you guys think? Let's leave that for now. I'm feeling it. I think it's adorable. Um, and then how about just some like regular old pants? Doo -doo -doo. Yeah! I like him, you guys. I think he's real cute. Give him some like, little matching shoes. Aww! Okay, guys, this is Aiden. Oh, I didn't realize there's something on the back of the shirt. It's still cute. All right, this is Brenton, and he looks pretty much exactly the same. Uh, should we give him the same hair? I don't know, he's hilarious, so I think that maybe like a funky hairstyle would be kind of cool for him. Do we have funky hairstyles? Let's see. Aww. Aww. We're doing this one. We're doing it. I can't not. <laughs> All right, so since he's hilarious, I kind of picture him in like just something really whatever, really casual. 
I doubt he really cares too much about his appearance. So... Yeah, I think that's pretty good. I really like this vest over the shirt thing. Let's just give him some white sneakers. For full body, we'll just keep it boring with the black tux. <laughs> I mean for formal. Did I say full body? I meant for formal. <laughs> he can wear this cool jersey for his active wear. With some shorties. That's pretty cute for sleep. Okay, gang, here is Brenton. Wow, that took a really long time. Oh, by the way, here's Mia. She's a chunky babe. She had purple eyes, so I just kind of left it that way. Yeah. And then here's Romeo. Isn't he just, like, really just unique looking? I don't know, maybe it's just me, but I've never seen a toddler like that before. Oh, man. <laughs> I just spent like 15 minutes in create a sim and it really like fries my brain because I focus so hard and I like forget to blink sometimes and yeah <laughs> it's not good okay oh my gosh I am so thankful that we have kids now oh my gosh I'm so happy I'm so happy they can probably be in this room with the in the room with me i will add let's see what's a cheap child's bed oh my gosh i can't even afford one <gasps> i'm gonna have to delete i'm gonna have to delete three of those oh we have three kids oh my goodness okay well <laughs> This is all we can afford at the moment! So I doubt, like, they're all gonna be sleeping at once, right? What is this? What the heck is this? Just put that in your inventory, I guess? Oh, it's a tablet. Why was it just floating there? <laughs> all right! Yes, this has already been such a successful episode. Homegirl is pregnant. And I'm so happy. Who's this? Oh, you're a teen. Well, that just won't do, will it? Romeo, come get some grilled cheese. Oh no, don't. Don't get the grilled cheese. It's spoiled. Get the salad. Get the salad. You guys, I just realized the pizza never came. What's up with that? That was such a waste of $25. I'm so sad. I wonder if that's a glitch, but ew! Look at this sink. So gross. Oh my gosh. Please clean. Clean. Clean, clean, clean. I know you're miserable, but like this house, it's disgusting. Talk like a pirate. I hate talk like a pirate day. She's having a moment for herself. How peaceful. Go ahead and use the toilet before you pee yourself. And then let's cook grub. Um, I wonder what the kids want. What's cheap? <laughs> Let's make a faux BLT, shall we? Romeo can now walk faster and dance to music. Good boy. Yeah, I know he's very hungry. He's always very hungry. He's a fussy baby. Fun times, yeah? How can you be pregnant and on your menstrual cycle? That makes no sense. I got in a fight with someone at school about which void critter is more powerful. The Arctic Horn, of course. Of course. Um, I'm starting to miss a toy I can't find. Keep looking for it, yo. You got this. Oh no. Wait, mail but no bills? That never happens. No, I don't want to meet you someplace. Bye bye. Can the kids take care of the toddlers, I wonder? Like, what's up with him? His fun is very low, and so his is so is his energy. So he's just gonna go to sleep right now. That's great. Both of the toddlers are asleep. Yo, bunk down. 
Bunk down, don't nap. Good boy, do the dishes. Oh no, just replace that. <laughs> we have like no money, what are we supposed to do? Can the kids get the mail, I wonder? No, shoot. There's probably toys in there that are their birthday gifts that we could sell. Hey, who's that? Who are you? Atticus Arroyo, are you a young adult? You are. Okay, girl, time to get up. Uh, ahoy me, matey. Um, Avast their villain. Let's do a funny introduction. Please don't leave. Did he leave? No, don't go, don't go. We need you. We need you. Yay, he stuck around. Hello. How are you? Kiss hands. Let's see if he takes that. Four. The Oh. I'm nervous. He's like, he looks really suspicious of us. Girl, kiss his hands. Come on. Uh, that's why. <gasps> oh no! Barbdo. <laughs> Ask for money. <laughs> this is not going well. Ladder, maybe? How come no one likes us anymore? It used to be so easy for us. Oh, fine. You know what? We don't like you anyway. Here's Mortimer. What's the one Fruit. Winnie. Oh my god! You know what? We don't want to talk to you anyway. Just go away. Go away. Oh look, he's cleaning up our mess. I thought you didn't like us. Whatever, I ain't complaining. You do you, uh, Atticus. And look, he's taking out our trash too! He knows we're struggling! <laughs> Oh, what a nice man. What a nice man. Bye. Thanks for um um doing our chores. You missed a few spots though. <laughs> what is up with these tablets just like floating? Can you stop doing that, please? I'm still puzzled on how she can be pregnant and be on her menstrual cycle at the same time. That really doesn't make any sense at all. I wish the kids could give toddlers a bath that would be so dope and so very helpful oh you are such a good girl no I don't want to come over so we really need to um, figure out how we're gonna make money because as of right now it's not looking so good we got lucky and got invited to that alien planet last time so we were able to sell some things, but as of right now, it's not looking good. Okay, gang, let's figure out who our next baby daddy is going to be. Marcus Flex? Oh my gosh, he's married to Kareem. We had a baby with Kareem. Wow, that's spicy, isn't it? Let's, um, let's invite him to hang out and get our relationship with him up. We can have babies with both of them. How crazy would that be? Yay, he'll be right over. That's what I'm talking about. Ooh, he's here with the promptness. Get to know him a little bit. How about discuss interests? Um, and then maybe brighten his day? Oh, she's gonna pee herself. She's going to. Everyone who comes over, like, does our chores for us. That's so sweet, isn't it? Oh, 
Why do they have to go all the way out there? Don't, don't, don't do it! Oh, oh my god, she did it. Let's offer him a rose, see if he takes it. I feel like that always works, but it hasn't been working lately. Oh my god, she's naked. No! Yes, please come over. Please. I think we can probably ask him for a bath once he gets here. Yes, we can. Talk to stranger. Um, should we wake him? Should we wake him? I wonder if we can ask our dad for money. Like, is that a thing? Argue about who's better, make fun of adults. Beg for new toys? Yeah, let's do that. She just peed herself again! Are you joking? You are so unbelievable. Freaking unbelievable. Did he get you a toy? Nope, you just have homework? That's just great. Oh, that reminds me. We should probably check the mail. Um, hopefully there's something in there that we, that we can sell. We can sell this upgrade part. Because we are broke! Who left the fridge open? I didn't even know that was like a thing that could happen. Okay, what'd we get? A classic woodmobile for 20 bucks. That's going straight in there. 50 bucks, very good. And then a rubber ducky for 90. Heck yeah, that's gonna help us pay our bills. Just have some chips, alright? Have some chips, and then watch TV, and then put your bet butt back to bed. It's almost Mia's birthday, yay! That means it's almost Romeo's birthday, yay! And then we won't have any toddlers, at least for a little while. Stoked. Oh, great, now the TV's broken. Oh, yeah, yay! That was like our only source of fun. All right, time to get up. You really need to give a bath to Romeo. He is disgusting. Are you still watching it? It's broken. Weirdo. Bye. Thanks for nothing. All you did was come over and break our TV. <sighs> you... She seriously just peed herself again. Pregnant chicks, they're hard. They're hard work in this game, I'll tell you what. She's gonna do it again! Oh my god! This whole time I've been trying to get her to take a shower and go to the bathroom. And she just keeps passing out and then she wakes up. And she freaking pees again. Like, look at how fast her bladder goes down. Why? Why won't you take a shower? Jeez. This sucks. Oh my gosh, she's gonna get out and pee herself again. Watch. Oh my gosh, she actually made it. I can't believe it. And we have bills. Okay, we have bills. We got a broken TV. She just passed out in a puddle of her own pee. And now it's gone, so does that mean she, like, wiped it all up with her body? That's... Next level, y'all. This is next level. Oh! There she goes again! Can you just have the baby already? Like, I can't deal with this. I can't. Oh! Are you... How many times is that? Five? Five this episode. Oh, great. Aiden swiped an object while at school. That's just lovely. And they all have projects, which will definitely not be done. But I do want to enroll you in the after-school activity. I don't think that costs any money, right? Let's see. Drama club. Yeah, let's put her in drama club. Yes! Thank you! Okay, go to the bathroom, please. Go.
I hate this game. <laughs> I'm kidding, I don't. I definitely don't, but wow, that was stressful. Alright, let's see what we got. A girl. Okay, you guys. I took some notes of some names that you guys suggested. Um, Let's see. Alright, let's do Violet. I absolutely love that name. It reminds me of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Violet. Another girl? Oh my gosh, how exciting. Okay, what's another V name? Um, let's see. I don't see any other V names right now from what I've written down, but let's see. There's Veronica, Vanessa. Let's do Veronica. I actually like that name. Oh. Twins! Woo! And our house is officially full. Okay, that's great. Yay! Time to take a shower. Oh, no, 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 no. What are you gonna do? View the easel? Really? That's what you want to do after having this baby? Having those babies? <laughs> I'm confused. Okay, we definitely need another bathroom, but we can't afford it. Okay, guys. I was just in the middle of struggling hard and it's all, it's their birthday now. Okay, thank God. Just look at this. Smelly babies, sparking TV, puddle of pee, paint, stinky kids everywhere, broken toilet. This is the worst. This is the worst. This is the worst. All right. You are going to help them blow out the candles. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Come on. Gosh. Okay, here we go. She is going to be a quick learner, so we'll give her the mental aspiration. Okay. Nope, no bed. Nope, nope, nope. All right, and then you're going to help blow out the candles, Romeo. Let's get it. Come on. You can do this. <sighs> a sweetie. How cute. I love it. Um, he can have the social butterfly one then, too. Yay. Okay, you can go to bed now. <laughs> We can replace the toilet, but uh, it's probably not a good idea. Okay, okay, okay. Who's this? Who's this? This is Romeo. Okay, let's let's modify. Modify. Oh gosh, this freaking challenge, man. This freaking challenge. Okay, so Mia, this is her. Um, she had like strawberryish blonde hair, like we did. It was like. It was kind of like that color. Should we give her this hair? All right, so she is going to be the brainiac of the family. Why does that look so cute on her? Why do I want to keep this? I know it's probably like a swimsuit, but it's just so cute. She's a chunky babe, which I love. Uh, you're definitely not wearing a grass skirt for your formal wear. I'm sorry, it's just not gonna happen. Um, you can wear that. Whatever. It doesn't matter to me. <laughs> We're probably never going to see you in your formal wear anyway. Okay, guys, here is Miss Mia. She's real cute. I love that she has our hair color. And okay, so for Romeo, I kept him pretty much the same. All I did was give him different brows and lashes, but... Since he had the curly hair as a toddler, I thought we would keep the curly hair going into uh, child years. This, I don't have any custom content curly hair, so this is like the only one that I'm able to use. <laughs> and I can't be picky with hairs because I'm gonna have a hundred kids and they can't all look exactly the same. So I'm gonna have to use some Max's hair, which is fine. I'm not really uh, tripping on it, but yeah, there's Romeo. I hope you guys like him. I'm so happy that they're not toddlers anymore. It's gonna be like really easy for a minute here. 
Oh, man. It's gonna be really sad that once they're teams, we're gonna have to, like, move some out. But you know what? It is what it is. So now that we're not pregnant anymore, we're gonna have to, um... Oh my gosh, the toilet. Oh my gosh, you're gonna have to get up and repair this. I'm really sorry, but your kids need to pee. Okay, well, this is definitely a low point. I thought that when we had toddlers it was a low point, but like, this is just bad. She's peed herself at least eight times in this episode. Um, there are just pee piles everywhere. The TV is broken. I, I just want to cry. I want to cry. We're selling these. So we need more children's beds. Insufficient funds. You're joking. All right. Well, it is what it is. Okay, so we have to pay our bills, so I'm going to sell this broken TV. 590? That's a good chunk of change for a broken TV. I'm also going to sell one of these little tablets. Maybe I should sell two. And maybe I should sell this little plant. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is so sad. This is so freaking sad. I feel really bad for these kids. Like, if a social worker were to come over, can you even imagine? Who's that? Is that Mortimer? Yeah, it is. I can t already tell by the red. <laughs> we really need to get her in a good mood because... I need her to get pregnant again. Like, that is the main goal right now. Finally, her energy is like in the yellow. There we go. Okay, time to get up. Who's calling? A teacher caught Aiden looking at another student's test. Um, I'm sure it was a mistake. That doesn't happen. Did you pay the bills? Good. Okay, what did we get in the mail? We're selling that. <laughs> I'm selling these common upgrade parts. Alright, what is wrong with these children? Okay, who can we invite over to impregnate us? Um... I mean, we can invite Cliff over and see if we can, like, do it now. But I doubt it. I doubt it. Let's give it a try, though. Thanks, Kareem. Cliff is a vampire and can't come over right now. Well, that's an issue, isn't it? Let's try it with Atticus again. Um, he seems like a solid... A solid choice for us. If he's not married, at least I don't think. I think he likes us! Oh my god, no! Oh, why? Why don't you- She's very confident, so maybe we should try our luck with someone else. Um... Who, though? <laughs> Let's try inviting him over again. He's a vampire too, so I don't know if it's gonna work, but we could try it. Hi! Did you just like stumble upon our doorstep or? Come on, introduce yourself. You're very confident, so maybe. Propose crazy scheme. Yes, <gasps> Yay, it's working! Finally! Oh my gosh, finally. We can already first kiss. Oh my god. Oh, sometimes it's like so easy and other times it's so freaking hard. 
Can so we try for baby? Why? Uh, oh, the household is too big. Oh, no! Oh, Shoot. Well, at least let's get this romance up, yeah? And that'll get her fun up, too. He's gonna be our next victim. He's gonna be the next father of our children. Okay, guys, I'm gonna leave this part right here. I have been filming for so long and I didn't even notice. <laughs> See, like, this is- this episode was probably the worst of them all. She's passed out in her own pee twice. And she's peed herself, like, eight times. So, yeah, I would say that's definitely a new low. Uh, if you guys have any advice, please leave me a comment. And please keep commenting names. Uh, you're really helping me out, because I definitely could not think of 100 baby names on my own. <laughs> I love you guys so much, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!